This segment is sponsored by the Wright Group of Remax Metro Plus. Well, now it's time for some real estate talk. Casey Wright with the Wright Group at Metro Plus is back in studio to talk about a famous real estate phrase everyone has heard, location, location, location. So Casey, what does that mean? Obviously, people know, all right, you want to be in somewhere that's popular, but what are some of the common denominators that people look for in location? Yeah, location, 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 really it talks about school district if people want to be in good schools, yeah. but some people don't have kids and they're not looking to have kids. So they don't really care about that school district, but if they do a lot of activities downtown or close to work, they need to be close to those as well. And are you seeing that it's kind of a shift where the greater location, the more leniency on the needs in the home and vice versa, the more needs in the home, location starts to go down a little bit? Yes, I would say it depends on, I mean, there's a ton of new development downtown yeah. too. So a lot of people are wanting to get in there at the bottom floor. So oh. then when the values go up, like where Children's Hospital is, like they're doing tons of renovation down right. there. So I see those prices going up dramatically as Man, well. you're so knowledgeable about this. And you brought us a location that's pretty incredible. Let's show the pictures and talk about this property, Casey. Yes. We have a property that's hitting the market in the middle of January. It's okay. in Upper Arlington. It's 3864 Kyoka Avenue. It's a three bed, two and a half bath ranch with main floor laundry. I like you. Wait, say that again. Main, main floor, floor laundry. laundry. Oh. Way to see laundry room. Okay. It is fantastic. The outside looks incredible. Yes. It's one of those mid-century ranches. Um, my sellers have done wonderful updates. They gutted the kitchen completely, added new countertops, wow. new cabinets, granite, uh, sorry, granite countertops. Yeah glass tile backsplash, beautiful farmhouse sink as well. There's that laundry room right there. It's great. And in addition to that, what is it about this property's location uh, that makes it so special? The school district, and there's okay. even an elementary school in the neighborhood as well, which is great. Oh, nice. In your close proximity to highways, and it's probably about a 15 minute drive to downtown. So if people are buying, maybe they don't know exactly the location that they want. Are there a couple of things they should look for that way they're getting the best value for their property? Yes, I would say look at the trends. I mean, how desirable is the neighborhood okay. where they're wanting to be? And also, again, how quickly will it take you to get to work? What are your daily activities? If you go to the gym, do you go downtown? Really, it depends on those. I'll tell you, with this well. home right here, I would never leave the house because it's so <laughs> nice. Look at that room right there. So that's going on the market in mid-January, correct? Yes. Mid-January, we're going to list it for four twenty-four nine. Nice. Now we saw the outside of that ranch, and it looked incredible. What are the elements of curb appeal that a people look for, and b they should have if they're selling their home? Yes. When we typically meet with sellers, that's the biggest thing because that's yeah. the first people buyers see when they walk into the house. Right. So definitely freshly mulched flower beds, edge the flower beds some bright color flowers perhaps on the front porch. And also I always say a bright front door sells a house too. Really? Mm -hmm. So it's not something that would deter someone. Now that extra punch is actually attracting buyers? because yes, it catches their eye. Wow, I wouldn't have thought about that. You yeah. feel like, and that's the thing you said, that keep track of the trends. Because maybe 10 years ago, if you put a red door in the front, people were like, oh no, it's a red door. <laughs> now you're going, oh, it's the red door house. Yes, exactly. Like we did a flip in Westgate and it had a bright yellow front door and a lot of people commented on it and how bright it was and catches their eye. I love that. So property we just saw mid-January, but I know you have other properties to see as well. How do people get in contact with you, whether they're buying or selling their house? Yeah, just for free, text or call me, 740-502-1467. And Casey, is there a website people can go to? Yes, it's rightgroup.searchholmescolumbus.com. Awesome. Always a pleasure awesome. to see Thanks you in so studio. Much. You bring the best properties, man. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back.